Tonight, a life changed forever for a teen trying to walk along the railroad tracks. Thanks for watching. I'm Anita Blanton. And I'm Tom Shad. This was breaking news at 4 o'clock. And tonight, we can tell you that teen was taken by helicopter to Sentara Norfolk General. The 16 year old was hit by a CSX locomotive and lost his foot. Yeah, 10 on your side. Liz Kilmer joins us live from the hospital where the teen continues his path to recovery. Liz? Yeah, and Tom Anita, he's perhaps lucky to be alive tonight. We're told that train was coming from behind him when he was struck and then apparently dragged uh, several feet. Now, neighbors say they often see people walking dangerously close to those railroad tracks and that it was only a matter of time before something tragic like this happened. Now that it has, they say they at least feel happy that they were there to jump in and help this victim. And then the whistle was blowing for a long, long time. <laughs> the usual toot people living along these train tracks are used to hearing. But they don't wail on the horn like that. I thought that was odd. Within seconds, they realized what was happening. At first he was screaming, somebody help me. I heard him yelling for help. Help me, help me. Michael Polavino says he jumped the fence to the tracks, discovering a 16-year-old boy who had just lost his right foot. Just went there and uh, compressed, elevated the leg, had him put his head down so that he wouldn't pass out. Um, and then just talk to him to keep him calm. A shoe and tossed belongings show the area where the crash occurred. Paulovino believes the boy was dragged. You could see from where the initial blood was until where his foot was. Police say the boy had been walking along the tracks in this direction and that the train hit him from behind. Among his belongings were headphones. Police are investigating whether he could have been listening to music. The only thing that he mentioned to me was he was walking along the tracks and then he doesn't remember what happened. I do want to stress that uh, do not walk down the tracks. But neighbors say people do it all the time. Even our crew saw a group. Time to go to the mall or to the store or something all the time, every day. <laughs> They're back there. A walk turned tragic for one boy. Paul Avino says the boy brought up his love for basketball. The Good Samaritan offered words of encouragement. And I said, you know, for the amount of strength that you've shown as throughout this, you can do anything in life. You're 16 years old, so don't let this stop you. And that victim could technically be charged with trespassing because this was on CSX property. A company spokesperson tells me that this was the locomotive and two cars. This was an inspection train meant to make sure that the railroad track was safe. Now, meantime, police continue to investigate. Tom and Anita, back to you. All right, thank you, Liz. We first told you about this breaking news on our Wavy News app. So for any breaking news coverage, download that app today.